Hello folks, Isaac Weiss here. We have just wrapped up Google Summer of Code 2020 week 11 out of 12 or 13 depending on how you count. So either way we're drawing near the end of things here. As you can see I have a somewhat different recording setup. I am no longer using QuickTime. I am in fact on a whole new operating system. So that transition has been interesting. Part of the reason that I'm recording this video um, in a week when there isn't really a whole lot to show off is in order to make sure the technology works um, with this uh, open broadcasting system here on Windows 10. Thanks Mark Sabatella for demonstrating its use. So as I mentioned um, we're near the end of things so I'm glad to report that I have implemented all the features that were on my agenda. Um, the final one being automatic numbering of consecutive measure repeats. Um, so as you can see, each of these is a one measure repeat, but the number that displays above it indicates its place in the series. And there are some style options regarding this. Um, ah, Windows, why don't you behave the way Mac OS does? I'm, I'm just uh, complaining. I like to complain. Okay. So you can turn that numbering on and off. Um, alternatively, you could just display a one above every single one of them, which would go along with the two and four that display on two measure and four measure repeats. Um, you can choose to add parentheses to these numbers, and you can also choose the interval. So right now, every single one is being done. You can also have them every two measures, two, four, six, eight, ten, every three, three, six, nine, every four, probably the most common, so maybe I should make that the default number, the fourth and the eighth, etc. Um, or maybe five. Um, and putting them uh, more closer together kind of helps show the use case for them. When they're all spread out with four measures per line, it's easy to see where you are in the series, but when it's just a whole bunch in a row, your eyes can glaze over and you're like, wait, where am I in, in my counting? It's the fifth time, this is the tenth time. And yeah, that's 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 it. That's uh, the final feature that I had to implement. And now, of course, um, I have to turn my attention to fixing up everything, um, writing a lot of tests. That's going to be uh, mostly what I spend this week on. And then after that, I'll just be wrapping up, uh, creating my final video, demonstrating all the features that I worked on over this Google Summer of Code 2020. That's all for now. Bye.